Hello everybody, Kanji here. Today we're back on the Windcraft server. We are going to go help farm, I guess. Ow. You know what? No. That's not okay, sir. You do not hit people. Bad. It's like I'm talking to my daughter. Alrighty then. So, we are going to begin the quest. Do, 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 do. Do, do. Leaving rodents. We're looking for Kelry, this guy. <laughs> ah, excuse me, there's that uh whoo, that sneeze I was talking about earlier. Alright. Allergies are really bad down here right now. Oh, ho, ho, a fresh recruit. Yes, sir. Alright. Good to see the army is starting to grow again. I've been waiting for a bit to help uh waiting for a bit of help from someone with with some backbone. You see I have a bit of a rat infestation on my farm. Nothing I can't handle myself, I, I can assure you. But you see, one of the blighters stole my wedding ring and my wife would kill me if she ever found out. I don't know which one took it, but if she sees me uh, looking for it, she will find out. So could you go uh, thump a few of them and find out? Bring me back one wedding ring as soon as you find it. Oh, don't tell my wife. Uh, if you're able to help me, I'll reward you kindly. Look, dude. I am trying to read to people here. Oh. Five more levels until you get the bash upgrade. Yeah, there was something about getting a some kind of upgrade. Uh a level ten, I thought. Something about charge? Maybe now I can like no? What was that? Alright, I don't need bone meal. Uh what what are you? A wedding ring. Wow. That was that was stupid easy. Back so soon, that means you found it. Yes, yes I did. Here, give it to me and hopefully my wife won't see. Oh. This isn't my ring, this is a washer. The dang rodents must be in the nest. They really will eat anything. Maybe you could take a look in their hive for me? I know it's a horrible place and I have been meaning to close it up. But the chances are the rats we are looking for is in there. It's over in the field. You don't have to make sure my wife doesn't see you. Bring one ready ring as soon as you can take it from the right. Stole the nest in the cave is right over there. Alright, well at least it's not actually going to be that easy. Because that was insanely disappointing. Now I don't know where over there is, but I assume he's, he said it was in the field, right? Away with you. You too. I can't see nothing. Alright. Up here, maybe? Over here? No? No? Yeah? Boom! Rat nest. Alright. Get out of here. We're vermin. Alright. Gonna come through and destroy all these little rats, and then when we get to the end, there's gonna be like this level 10 huge beefy looking rat thing. Hey! 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 Oh. Alright. Well, that was still disappointingly easy, so we will be doing multiple quests this run through. Do -do 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 -do. I guess no good deed is too small for a knight of my stature. Or lack of. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Guys, come on now. You have no chance. Did I pick up that emerald? Get back here. Yoink. Yoink. Sir, I'm gonna trample through your carrot field, sir. So I don't feel like going through the weed again. That was kind of a pain. Seem like that wheat's higher than normal. Uh, inventory space first. You go away, you go away. Oh, you found it. Thank the king. I think I mm, might have gotten away with it after all. Well, thank you so very much, soldier. Are you. Uh, are you looking to head to Delta soon? It's a hub city for the whole province. Everyone goes there. Uh, I wanted to go once, but my wife wouldn't let me. You should go. Uh, just follow the Emerald Trail through the forest. There are dangerous monsters there, though, so make sure you're strong enough. Anyway, here's a small word for helping out. Alright, so I got some emeralds. Just, just die. Just all of you. Just die. I don't need that. What I do need to do is sell off a bunch of crap. Because my inventory fills up pretty quick. Die. 
So I'm going to go do that real quick. And I will be back. Alrighty guys, we are back and we are going to be doing the Cook's Assistant Quest. I can't believe this, what is happening to me. The king ordered me to bake cakes for all those new recruits. Unfortunately, I don't have the ingredients to make them and nobody sells those items in the fort. You think you can bring me two eggs, a bucket of milk, and three wheat really quickly? Uh, honestly, I don't know about that. I know where to get the wheat. Uh, and maybe the, the eggs. Find those groups again. Well, those were back. Way back. I don't know if I can get to those. Uh, while we're doing that, let's go ahead and get Spider Cave. Uh, that's in the forest north of Maltic. Where's Maltic? Excuse me while I go check the map. Alright, Maltic is a little ways away. It's over by the uh, decrepit sewers. So we're gonna we're gonna head that way and keep our eye out for wheat eggs and a bucket of milk. I have no idea where to get any of those. Apparently in the fort, uh, am I going the right way? I should be heading west. Let's check here, facing west. Alright, so I need to find the western exit, which should be over here. And we are just going to go out on an adventure. It's not the exit. Alrighty then, we're back on track. Now, considering it is a little bit of a walk, I might go ahead and skip on over to the... Uh, the place north of Maltic, I think it said. But first, we're gonna go over to the wheat farm and get the uh, the wheat from him, the wheat merchant. But I haven't seen a milk merchant or a egg merchant, so I don't know. But we're gonna go this way and find out. I assume it should be around here somewhere. It's a starting quest, so. Uh, whoops. Right. Uh, one wheat for... Okay. Would you just go... I forgot I left all my money. Furious wife. That no good, lousy, cooks, clumsy man. Did you really think I wouldn't notice he even place his ring? He's been wearing gloves whenever he sees me. When he gets home, and he's going to have more than rats to worry about whether he found it or not. Oh, sorry, dude. Alright, so I can get the wheat, but it has no monies. So I can't get the wheat. So we just gonna go this way, and I'm gonna do a time skip. All right. Anyway, so um, I think I just found a milk merchant. Now all we need is an egg merchant. All right, that was weird. Uh, haven't confirmed that yet, but I just saw this. Uh, Kato Ranch. Uh, there's a wheat farm right over there, so I'm hoping they have milk and eggs. And if they do, they do have chickens. Scared wheat. Alrighty then. Cows have the leather. Urgh, oh, boy, zombie. Alright, so the cows before weren't dropping this stuff. So hopefully we can get. Yeah, we got some eggs from the chicken. Alright. I don't know what the deal with this wheat is, but it's scared. And I can get oh. stuff from it, so whatever. Um, so that solves all of our problems except for the milk, which if we can get from a cow, would be nice. I'm pretty sure it was three eggs. Hell, I don't remember. I'll check the thing. Bucket merchant. Yes, please. All right. So now I need two eggs, one milk, three wheat. I need one more wheat, and we are good to go. 
I see you scared wheat. You make no sense, but whatever. Alright, we got everything we need. Um, now, I'm not going to go back and turn this in right now because we're too close to uh, where we were trying to get to. What do, you, what do you do? Nothing? Can I sell all this leather that I just got? Like, is there a, a crafting system in the game or something? Because that would be kind of nice. And if not, they should implement that. Alright, so we got all these zombies here, and I know I'm level 11, they're level 3, and therefore we'll have crap experience. There's just too many not to kite, and, uh, yeah, there's too many. To not get all that lovely experience, so. Cut through you guys right here. You! You know what, those keys are in no... Boom. They are in no short supply. You just gotta kill this guy a couple times. Uh, did I kill the scared version? Okay. See, I've already got two of those keys. Alright, here in a second I'm gonna have to go check the map. Alright, make sure that it's a share. Uh, scared wheat. Ooh, what are those? Crabs. Crab hiding in sand. Nice. Alright. Ooh. Yes, please. Murders. It'd be cool if they could actually do some uh, custom mobs for some of these. What are you? Why are there beds and stuff in here? Greedy zombie. Whoa. They just spawned out of nowhere, man. I want these chests. Too bad. Damn, none of them do anything. Alright. Would you people leave me alone for like 10 seconds? Ooh. Yeah, give me, give me those. Man, this is like their spawn spot. Alright, what, what, what do we got here? Can we not get any of these? That Mr. Greedy Zombie. Yeah, there's definitely something wrong with my, either my mouse or the game. I'm gonna... Well, I don't know. My mouse has been fine. Alright, what's hitting me? Go away. One of these chests gotta do something, right? That I just got backed into a corner for no reason whatsoever. Or I'm completely missing the point here. Right, well. This has been fun. But I'm out. I got things to do. And y'all are giving me a headache. Probably from all the uh, stabbings. Alright, so there's just a random hole in the ground with a bunch of crap. Once I get somewhere safe, I can check my map, make sure I'm going the right way. And if not, well, this has been fun exploration. I'll use a teleportation scroll to get back to... Uh, the place we were at? Raggy, that's it. My memory is not so good. Ooh, loot chest. Maybe. Yo yo. Alright, six emeralds. Is there no safe place? Alright, I'm back. Alright, we're going the right way, but we are not even kind of close, so... We're just gonna go up the coastline here. 
just the size of this world. Even if you don't want to play this game, you should you should go check out the map. It is crazy big. What's this house? Oh, Mango. Hi, my name is Omango. I'm a resident of the Melted Village on top of the hill. Alright. As you may know, our people came to your land years ago, and this is the ship they used. They brought uh, lots of luxurious goods with them. Most of them got lost in the crash. But recently, this hole you can see has been opened. It's believed that fortune is hidden beneath the waves. Unfortunately, nobody's been able to explore this hole. It's too deep. No creature can survive underwater that long. My old friend Sare is a fisherman, and I know that he has a very special helmet. If you can get your hands on this helmet and find the treasure, I'll give you part of it. Sare is probably fishing close by on his boat. Talk to him, and he can help us. He's not short of a kind heart. When you finally have the helmet, explore the ship and bring back four ancient treasure. Good luck. Sounds like a quest to me. Underwater, isn't that the one we're going for? Uh, yes, it was. Awesome. Alrighty then. So now we gotta find a person in a boat. He has the breathing cap. He said he was probably fishing nearby in a boat. So let's see if maybe he's just not loaded up. Maybe, possibly. Be nice if I could build a boat, then maybe I could find him. I assume you'd be able to see him from the shoreline, although my render distance is kind of cut short. You know, I haven't checked my OBS in a while. I bet you anything I've recorded episode after episode, or I mean video after video, whatever. And uh, something's happened with the encoder, at least in one, causing it to skip around and mess up. There's got to be something up here, right? Nobody just makes a random floating island with torches on it. Two unused skill points. Oh, people do make floating islands with torches on it for no reason. Right. What is that? Nice view. Alright. We have skill points. Let's, uh, oh, there's a boat. We're gonna go with strength again. Get our old spear out. What is this? What are you? What is that? What are all these things? Nib in the forest. Awesome. That's actually pretty convenient. What are you? Junk merchant. Son of a. Alright. Junk shop. Emerald. One bone meal. One rotten flood. Wow! That's a lot. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, okay, never mind. Jump merchant. Well, that sucks. Uh, I assume there's someone that buys junk then. If there's somebody who sells junk. Can I steal all your monies? No. Hi. Hi. You. Get over here. Give me that key. Give me that key. I wonder why you gotta kill him three times to get the key. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That one gave me two keys. Because there was two of them. Alright. Uh, the only reason I'm chasing these guys down is because they're actually decent experience. They gave me like 37 apiece. Alright, so there's two skeletons perfectly right on top of each other that whole time. Come here, you. Where are you going? 35 experience. It's gone down. I'm level 12 already. Wow. Oh, I've got a couple weeks worth of videos. I've almost got a month ahead worth of videos by the time you guys see this. Uh, it'll probably be up the later half of that month, but as it stands, it is January 22nd-ish. Is where I'm sitting on this. And this probably won't be published till late February sometime. Man. Alright, uh, fishing net, nice. Very, very creative, I never would have thought of that. Are you fishing from the top of your mess, under your crow's nest? Did you know that would make sense? 
There you are. Is there fall damage? There is fall damage, but not very much. I feel pretty confident I can jump from a really high height and uh, be fine. Apparently spawn is that way. Alright. That's one way to do it. What? <laughs> uh, why are you looking at me like that? It's because I'm small, huh? I'll let you know that I caught fish that were twice your size. But why'd you hop on my boat, stranger? Ah, yes, I still have that useless breathing helmet. You want it, you'll have to do something for me first. You see, I've been fishing for the last three days, and it was... It is... Yeah. Going so well, I don't want to go back to uh, Nimrak for food. Give me something to eat and drink. Three pigmen meat and one milk will suffice. I'm a growing man. I need sustenance. The helmet will be yours after that. Alright, so we're going to have a lot of back and forth to go. Uh, you want a three pigmen me? Man. Alright. So the moral of this story is collect all the quests you can and do them all at once. Because now i got to go back and get more milk. I've got to go all the way back to the Nivla Forest so I can cut through to the pigmen to get meat. So basically I gotta make a big circle. You know what? This might not be a bad... the decrepit sewers might not be a bad place to go level up considering how many keys I've gotten and will get because of these guys here. Ha! Gotcha. Yeah, because I've gotten five. I've got two in storage right now. And they just pop up all over the place. So getting into that dungeon, it kind of makes the keys pointless if you ask me. But whatever. Anyway, I'm going to cut to the pigment now. Ooh, what is this? Do you buy junk, maybe? Big caravan. Uh, I can't read that through the grass. Can I get you? Nope, okay. Mask salesman? I can't talk right now. I've lost something rather valuable and I need to get it back quickly because I'm only staying here for a couple weeks. Please come back when you're level 21. Alright. Leave the forest this way. So we have a quest in this area? Ooh, loot. Yoink. Alright, we got a quest in this area somewhere. Zermi. But I don't know where. So we're gonna hop inside this house real quick. It's a big farm. And if we can find the entrance, we're gonna go inside where it's relatively safe. Wheat merchant. Can I get the house? Yeah. Alright. Let's explore for Anyway, I gotta get through the Nivella Forest so I can get to the zombie pigmen, so I will be back. So, I have just discovered if you come into these houses and break pots, you will get freaking emeralds. Which, of course, look like rupees. That is hilarious, that is awesome, and I don't ever want to stop playing this game. Oh. Alright, click on everything. Shit. Whoa! I don't know what just happened. Boom. Alright. Ah, this is going to have lots of money here soon. So I'm going to go into everyone's house. Smash all of their pots. And I need to go east. South, west, so east is that way. Alright, anyway, back to the pigment. Alright, so in my wanderings. Ooh. In my wanderings, I have found this cave of these zombie miners. So we will eventually get back to the pigmen. Bro, you ain't gotta shoot at me. We will eventually get back to those pigmen, but we're going to. Ah, he's shooting bones at me. With a hoe. He's shooting bones with a hoe. Alright, anyway. We will eventually get to the zombie pigmen, but for now I keep finding all kinds of crap, so... Yeah, distractions. Ah, uh, 
it looks like it's a really small tunnel, although those names over there would have me think otherwise. Holier. Those are level 30-somethings. Or 24. I don't think I want... I want to mess with that right now. Not that I know how. Attack underwater. Alright, anyway, back east. Alrighty guys, so I found another, another level level 74 corrupted gate. But I'm more interested in this. Uh, obviously the 74 I can't do. I feel like this is, you know, gonna be full of spiders. Especially this is gonna be full of the spiders that I hate the most, cave spiders. But you never know. Spider Guard level 16. Yeah, screw it. Let's do it. Come on, bro. Let's do this. Oh, we probably shouldn't be doing this. How much experience do you give me first off? 90 experience. I think we should be doing this. But not that many at once, I don't think. We ain't gonna be tightening these anytime soon. You are now entering infested pit entrance. Now leaving. All right. Wow. So just a couple of these. This is gonna be a good grind spot. You know, maybe it might not be a bad idea to kite them. I think it's going to take a little more, but uh, I think it'll be worth it for as much experience as they're giving me. And they really don't do all that much damage. I'm sure the boss is insane, though. See, I don't understand the vast level difference. If, it's, if you could be level 9 to get into the decrepit sewers, I would assume you should be able to defeat the boss. I mean, it shouldn't be easy by any standard. But, that was kind of ridiculous, honestly. Key collector. So, you need a key to get into all the dungeons. Easy, level 18, right. Die, oh, okay. So after Mr. Spider here, don't kill me. Oh. Well, that's one way to do that, alrighty then. And yet again, one more time, off to the zombie pigmen. Alright, so I ended up dying. Uh, luckily, I had just thrown my spear down, and I grabbed it right before they hit me, because if I had lost this, I would have been so screwed. But, I got these nice pair of trousers. Flawed golden leggings. Now, they don't do a whole lot, but uh, they give me a lot of health. Which, uh, these are more for like mages and stuff, but the good news is, oh wow, well hell, that, that would have been useful to know. Anyway, Emerald Trail this away, which also means, put you away, put you guys away, which also means we are going to be able to get to, uh, the pigmen a lot faster. So. Alrighty then, so we have made it back finally. So we're gonna get in here. Wait for okay. Now if I remember right, somebody in here had some uh ranged ability. Oop, yep, I hear him. Ow, ow, ow. You know what you all suck. Pretty sure it was you. Oh, well, that was easy. Alright, die, die, die. Give me your meat. That's all I want, uh, all I want is your meat. I got nothing out of that. Are those supposed to be like crossbows or something? No, you just suck. Okay. That's it. Um... 
Well, I'm just gonna grind this spot. Uh, let's see how long we've been recording here. 41 plus the brakes. I'm just gonna go for a few more minutes just in case. Um, I don't want it to be too short. I can deal with it being a little long. Die. Thank you. But yeah, I just want to make sure I cover because there's a lot of cutting of the clips. Looking at maps and whatnot. So. Ah! Figured you might want to watch me get slapped around by some weird looking zombie pigmen with regular pig heads. It's just weird. It looks like they're. Oh, they're pig zombies. Pig zombie man. I don't know, it looks more like a zombie man pig to me. What do you think? Does he give me 55 experience? Why am I not in here wrecking these things? Oh, 13. What the hell was that guy on? Anyway, I'm gonna get to level 13 and then cut the video, which is one more. You! Push me over the edge. Or don't. That's fine too. He'll do it. Ah. Boom, level 13. Alright. Get out of here real quick. That way I can do my outro without having to worry about dying. Alrighty guys, thank you for watching the video. If you liked it, please hit the like button. Uh, if you could just hit this button right here to subscribe. If you want to watch this video, uh, it should be something you're interested in. And if you want to see our latest video, click here and if you want to uh, get a notification every time I upload a new video up in the upper right hand corner turn on your notifications and you will get that message thank you for watching and until next time now